Hello and welcome to Inbisan News. You are watching English Bulletin with me, Ratnaka. The news in detail. Four antisocial stabbed a youth to death with a sharp edge weapon in a suspected rage incident in Kotwari area on Sunday night. The deceased Saif Ali Aliya Shah Rukh Shavkat Ali was a resident of Elimiya Khan Tulsibab Mahal. Cops have booked Bablia Vinayak, R.K. Patil and Bantujas and this connection. Initial probe revealed that Saif Ali was riding his motorcycle speeding the near Aradha Jewelers shop at Ganesh Nagar around 11 p.m. His bike brushed against one of the accused vehicle. The accused caught him. He and accused had a heated argument which turned violent. The accused took out sharp edge weapon and stabbed Saif Ali, killing him on the spot. After recording the statement of Sheikh Munna Sheikh Wahab, Kotwari police registered an offense under the section 302 and 34 of the Indian Penal Code against the accused quarter. In the second wave, the administration had taken special note of the cooperation rendered by the doctors working in the municipal sector and in the private hospital in the district. The administration will expect the same help even in the third wave, appealed the Energy Minister and Guardian Minister Dr. Nitin Rao. In the presence of the Guardian Minister, the Office Bearer of Indian Medical Association and Vidarbha Hospitals Association discussed various issues with the Guardian Minister at the Divisional Commissioner's Office today. The meeting was attended by the Divisional Commissioner Dr. Sanju Kumar, District Collector Ravindra Thakre, Municipal Commissioner Radha Krishnan, B. Indian Medical Association President Dr. Sanjay Devadari, Vidarbha Hospital Association Secretary Dr. Alok Umre and other office bearers. The office bearers of the various organizations in the medical profession informed the Guardian Minister about the problems they faced in the first and second wave. It was on February 13 when Nagpur district had witnessed 484 coronavirus cases. After that, the cases kept on rising. On Monday, after almost more than three months, the district registered 482 new cases in one single day. Of the 42, 482 cases, 9% who were tested positive are not the resident of the district. Nagpur Rural reported 227 new cases, while in the city, 246% came positive for the virus. The number of new positive cases in city 246 is also three months low as on February 12. Almost over three months ago, 268 persons had come positive for coronavirus. With these, the cumulative positive cases tally reached to 4,71,541. Of the cumulative, 1,518 persons who came positive are not the resident of the district. There is a slight rise in death count in Nagpur district as many as 29 persons became victims to the virus. Excessive use of steroid like drugs during treatment of novel coronavirus may lead to infection mucormycosis, that is black fungus. In such cases, one should immediately consult doctor as soon as symptoms appear. The most important aspect is to get treatment in time and get rid of the mucormycosis, advised Dr. Nikhil Kandurwar and Dr. Sandeep Anjanka during the COVID-19 dialogue. The Nagpur Municipal Corporation and IMA Nagpur branch jointly launched the concept of COVID Samwar on Facebook Live program on Monday. Famous ophthalmologist Dr. Kundurwar and Dr. Ajinki provided guidelines on COVID-19, eye problem and treatment caused by micromycosis and answered various queries raised by the citizens. Although micromycosis is a dangerous disease, it can be cured in a timely manner with the proper treatment. The news is reassuring that there is a cure for the ailment that has blocked patients who were earlier affected by COVID-19. Nagpur Municipal Corporation Innovative Campaign Lassikaran Aplaya Parisharat received an enthusiastic response from the citizens on Monday. Mayor Dayashan Kantiwari on Monday inspected some of the vaccination centers set up under this innovation scheme and expressed satisfaction over the arrangement made in this center. Under the NMC scheme, the first and second dose of Corona COVID Shield vaccine is being given to the citizens above age of 45. Vaccination has started at all the centers of the Nagpur Municipal Corporation. The mayor inspected the vaccination center at Sindhi Colony, Ashok Nagar, Sri Badi Marwadi Mahashwari Panchayat, Bhavan Vardhaman Nagar, Anna Bhau Sathe Hall, Tanda Pet, and Daji Primary School, Namak Ganj, Duneshwar Pete, Mahesh Kukraja, and their office peers were also present. At these centers, the citizens vaccinated themselves and their families, and arrangements were made for vaccination in their area itself. Citizens express gratitude to NMC administration for this facility. Well, that's all from this bulletin. For more updates in and around the city, stay tuned with NBC News. Till then, Ratnagar says goodbye. Please take very good care of yourself and family. Keep watching NBC News. 
सच दिखाए बिना छुपाए